When you walk into this building, you really feel special. You feel the love and the energy in the building. You feel the smiles, you feel the warmth. You feel like these people are part of my family. Our mission is to educate the whole child. We place equal emphasis on both their intellectual and social-emotional development. Our students emerge with a strong sense of identity and view the world through the lens of Torah. Teach each child the way he or she needs to be taught. By teaching the whole child, we are really helping the children grow as individuals. We use a responsive classroom approach where we actively teach social skills throughout our curriculum and where students are taught to be reflective and contributing citizens to our school community. They understand the way children think and they run with it. In today's age, students need to learn how to think, not what to think. Farkai offers a challenging general studies program that maximizes our students' full potential. Students develop critical thinking skills in approaching real-world problems. They analyze text, record data, debate ideas, and calculate solutions. We care about each and every child. We encourage the children to actively explore, to investigate, to take risks, and to really think out of the box. There's project-based learning going on in the classrooms. There's progressive education happening. The projects that they're given, whether it's art or even in Chumash, there's a creative spin to it, which keeps it exciting. We have the opportunity to always be on the cutting edge in terms of education and in terms of researching new approaches to education. So that allows us to move quickly and understand what's out there and how that would benefit our children. And that's happening every day at Barkai. A Sephardic identity is very unique. A Sephardic identity does not believe that there is a separation between Torah and the outside world. A lot of times when you deal with education, there's a lot of disconnects between different subjects. Barakai sort of gives you the whole picture and integrates everything together. We appreciate the arts. We appreciate music. We appreciate architecture. We appreciate history. If you believe God created the world, then everything that's around us, He's created. They're able to see the connections between their subjects, and they feel like their learning has a goal. The Barakai Shita draws its inspiration from a Mishnah in Pirkei Avot. It says, Hu haya omer, ben hamesh le mikra, ben ayesed le Mishnah, the Mishnah teaches us that when you're educating a child, you must educate them in a consecutive approach. Have them have a firm understanding of what they're doing now and then layer on the next subject afterwards. It is essential to every single Barkai student to recognize that our grandparents and their grandparents have given over to us the proper values in which to live every single day. The Fardic heritage is very much valued and very much instilled in the children. Therefore, from the earliest age, we have music being played in the classrooms, and soon enough through lower school, students will learn how to play instruments and have an appreciation for music. We sing the Torah with Tamim, but we also have Pizmonim. A Barkai student becomes proficient in Hebrew um, through immersion. All the lessons in school are delivered in Hebrew, and all the students respond in Hebrew. So the language comes so naturally to them. You know, there's something unique about taking a teacher who's been teaching in Eretz Yisrael, bringing them to America, and putting them in the classrooms and running programs. There's a flavor you get of Eretz Yisrael that you couldn't get just by teaching the course. I'm always amazed how easily my children can converse in Hebrew in Israel or even with Israelis in America. Immersion really works and as the earlier on that we do it, the more proficient they're going to be. And that's what we're doing here at Barkai. Our dedicated and educated staff are the secret to our success. My kids feel very comfortable to ask questions to their teacher, to approach them, to take risks. They really, really want to see them succeed. And they love them. They really love them and the children know it and, and it, they thrive because of it. I've seen how they've grown in Midot and how they treat each other with respect and care and what we're doing here is working. My children really have gained a lot from being in Barkai, a sense of self-identity, knowing who they are and being confident in who they are. I think when you understand that, anything that you sort of tackle in life um, becomes very approachable and very easy. I see my children as leaders in their Minyanim. A successful family 
is the product of three different institutions. The school, the home, and the community synagogue, the Knis. Barakai family is my family, and my family is part of the Barakai family. They're our partner in everything that we do, and the values that they have are the same values that every parent truly wants for their children. I think it's unique to the approach of the education, the child-centered learning that we have at Barakai, and that every child feels like I'm part of something bigger. Barakai lifts them up. They want to go to school. The doors that are going to open for them because of the amazing product that they produce is, is endless. They are sending these children out and they are developing them completely so that they could thrive. It's a great feeling as a parent to know that my child is getting the best possible education for them.